Okay, I've never done this before, so this will be pretty interactive. <laughs> feel free to laugh, because if you don't, I'll feel like I failed, so that's your job. My name is Anna, and I have known Jake for almost 10 years, and Alex for almost two. When Jake and Alex asked me to officiate their wedding, I was moved. I was overwhelmed. Uh, what an incredibly daunting responsibility and such a great honor. And I was filled with anxiety that I was gonna get up here and just start crying, which I almost just did. But before I could answer them, they excitedly added, yeah, and we wanted to open with shalom, bitches. <laughs> so <laughs> my fear of crying did subside after that. <laughs> While clearly this is clearly not a religious ceremony, it is no less sacred, and the vows these two are going to exchange are not diminished by that. All of us who are here today have already been a part of Jake and Alex's story. Maybe it's Alex and Jake, or if it was a Hollywood name, it would be like Jalex or a lake, but uh, so if I mess it up, we'll just go with Jake and Alex, okay? <laughs> I remember the first time Jake spoke to me about Alex. I asked him to tell me about her and the first thing he said, just blurted it out, was she's the most beautiful woman I've ever seen. So then I teased him and said, oh, you're falling for a pretty face then, are you? And he said, no, Anna, she's smarter than I am too. It's, <laughs> it's terrifying. So I, I didn't say, well, duh, but no, you know. <clears throat> but that was the moment that I knew Jake was all in. Okay, now I'm gonna cry. Okay. <laughs> After meeting Alex for the first time, I knew that he wasn't wrong. Alex brings the balance of thoughtful discernment to Jake's, we'll say spontaneity. <laughs> <laughs> They're both intelligent, responsible, hardworking, and share an occasionally twisted sense of humor that highlights almost every moment I've had with them. I'm sure you've all experienced it too. Most importantly, they share a common belief of what is priority, and with this ceremony, they are putting that into action. Jake, Whew. it's crazy to think this all started <laughs> from a message I sent you off of a dating app, and you're welcome. <laughs> I mean, my opening line wasn't the greatest. Um, it said something along the lines of, you're pretty cute, but I'm never going to Bremerton. <laughs> I know. So, I would have never imagined we would be where we are today, but looking at our growth as individuals and as a team, it's from the past three years, it's obvious that we're meant to be together. I remember our first date, well, our first dinner, and before the next 48 hours we spent together, uh, I had a gut feeling that you were gonna be somebody special someone who was going to have a real impact on my life. So I did what all girls do, and I texted my friend that night telling her I was gonna marry you one day. I'm a big believer in everything happens for a reason, and you are proof of that. You're so incredibly loving, so incredibly generous, so incredibly patient, and so incredibly loyal. I'm so excited for our future together and I have no idea what that future will hold and normally that would freak me out. <laughs> I'm a bit of a control freak. But I'm no longer afraid about the future because you're my future, you're my rock, you're my calm, you're my safety. I love you so much and I can't wait to spend the rest of my life with you. No, that's gonna be tough to follow. <laughs> <laughs> Alexandria. What a ride. <laughs> We're finally here. Um, I remember when I was growing up, I figured that getting married was just something that some people did and some people didn't do. I never thought I'd know what raw, real love was and how it would feel or how it changed someone's life. But when you came into my life, I found out real quick that can happen. Everything in my life got brighter, my problems got smaller. And you've changed my life for the better in every area. You've helped me become the man I want to be, and hopefully a man that you're proud to call your husband. Over the last 1,227 days, we've experienced so much together. And before we seal the deal, I want to thank you for a couple things. 
Thank you for being kind and loyal and dedicated. Thank you for being honest, supportive, and patient. And lastly, I wanna thank you for being willing to communicate through everything that comes our way. All these qualities make me feel important to you and that we can accomplish anything we want and solve any problem that life throws our way. So with the ring that I'm about to give you, I promise to love you wholly, without reservation, to work with you to attack problems, to open my mind and my heart to new things, to grow with you and be supportive in everything that you go after, to be your protector, your confidant, and your companion, to always pursue you and make you feel loved and wanted, and to love you as you have loved me for the rest of my life. By the trust given to me, by the state of Washington, and with all these witnesses here, I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss the bride. Nice! Jake and Alex are husband and wife. That's it. Searching for a sign